so now we have created an uh, uh, bot flow with hash trick which means for each and every input from user the chat bot will kick start yeah once it is done then we will click on the flow and you will be redirected to this you know uh, bot builder car page right so here we have two options one is ask a question and the other one is send a question right whenever you want an input from your user then the uh, card item should be in ask a question whenever you want to send out a message or response then it should be a send a message okay so we have a sample you know chatbot flow i will show you so this is how you know the chatbot flow is uh, needs to be you know, you know worked out so let's say the first message is you know uh, thank you for contacting us let's say i will start with ask and under questions i will say thank you for contacting us are you a new student or existing one correct and here you can have the options also since the requirement is yes and no you can have the options as yes and no yeah similarly you can have the variables also thank you for contacting us right you can say hello and you can add the contact name automatically and similarly to have a emoji you need to click windows and dot let's say then you can have you can have emojis also yeah and the response type is nothing but you know let's say if at all, if at all you are looking for an input from your user right let's say you are asking for uh, their phone number then the response type should be number let's say if at all you are asking for appointment time right then it should be uh, date and time let's say if at all you are going to collect an email id from your user then the response type should be email and so on so we have you know uh, many uh, such you know uh, data type you have to choose the appropriate one let's say in this case i i want to leave it as text itself since you know we are going to give this button option yeah let's say uh, and you know this is done so i will click on add a card has been created here okay so this card will kick start based on the intent is hashtag here right so whenever a user sends a hi message or hello or whatever then automatically the chatbot will kick start this question yeah the next is since we have two different options here we need to create a two different flow right let's say what if happen if a customer you know clicks on no right then this is a message let's say uh, i want to end this chat here itself then what i'll do i will drag a send message and update this message okay all the courses all about uh, fun free counseling yeah then what i'll do since i want to cut this you know chatbot over here what i'll do i will click on actions and i will move this chatbot to an unassigned bucket right let's say if at all you want to uh, move this uh, chat to one uh, particular person then you can choose our same conversation and you can choose the respective people also here okay let's say unnecessary conversation and then you can click on add so now you need to link this with no yeah and generally what will happen if a customer you know clicks on uh, s right and again you know i want to put it as send now message right so here you no know, please select an option to help me please have an option to help me so it will better yeah right what you can do is you can have this option under option cut tab and you can create multiple tabs over here and you can do all these options from here okay let's say you know there is a there's a red you know alert here because you know in the chatbot you know in each and every options you can have you can have only 20 limit characters and if it is exceeding 20 limit characters then you won't get this button kind of style 
instead of which you will get this one two three options if at all you are you want to sustain this button kind of option then you need to ensure that the uh, option characters are within 20 minutes uh, 20 characters and similarly let's say uh, since here we have more than three options so if it is more than three options and then less than 10 options then you will have an interactive you know, uh, button options so there are three different options one is this button where you know, we can have you can have three options if it is more than three and less than 10 and the character limit is at 20 then you will have an interactive uh, options if it is the character limit is you know more than 20 then you will have this one two three car options like that yeah so now i am going to click here as uh, add then i can join this over here so once the bot is ready then you need to click on publish that's it your bot is live and it is ready for usage you can do it at any point of time yeah.